Welcome, everyone, to another episode of Two Drunk Guys Watch. My name is Rory McLeod. I'm your host, and joining me for this episode are two lovely ladies. Say hi, Anna Louisa. Hello. And Sam Sano. I'm a lady. <laughs> you are a lady. And uh, so, as we know from your previous stints on Two Drunk Guys Watch, you are not partaking of the alcohol, but... I must ask, as I am contractually obligated to do so, what are you drinking? Yes, as I'm sure you heard, I opened a fresh can of LaCroix. I don't actually know how you're supposed mm -hmm. to pronounce it. Okay. And Sam, what do you got? I have a 12 fluid ounce Powerade Blue Edition. Wow. Wow. You're really uh, taking it to the limit there. Well, so uh, to make up for the lack of alcohol on that side of the ledger, um, I have in my Two Drunk Guys Watch beer glass, um, I have a Leinenkugel Lakeside Cherry, which is pretty good. Very nice. Um, yeah. And then when that runs out, I have about, uh, I would say, a finger and a half of Dewar's, um, which I've been working on for a while now. Um, my understanding is you started drinking at 2 p.m. today. Is that right? No, it was 3.30. Oh. Um, <laughs> But it wasn't continuous. I had one drink and then nothing for six hours. So um, anyway, and then if I manage to get through all that and I still need, I'm still sober, um, I have a Fireball uh, cinnamon whiskey, which I'll take a couple of shots of. So anyway, that's the alcohol rundown. So for this episode, we are checking out a feature film called Queen of the Amazons, which is a exciting action adventure film it's about Ana Luisa it is she is the titular <laughs> queen of the Amazons I know I don't I, I want to emphasize that so it sounds dirty but it's really not um, okay <laughs> or whatever and we also have uh some some awesome commercials okay <laughs> so everyone uh make sure to hit that like button and subscribe for notifications about future content grab your alcoholic beverage of choice if you go that way and we'll get started right about now. This is an egg, and I'm Julia Mead. And Wait, which one's with that magic egg. sheen in your hair, like an old fashioned This is your egg brain shampoo. on eggs. Except Wait Richard had not enriched cream My brain shampoo is eggs. with real eggs powdered into that the golden lotion. That could be Sam right there. Look at the look on her face. The best way to get the sheen of eggs in your hair is to put way. eggs See in your hair. See the clean and beautiful sheen on Louise's hair. Right, just crack You'll eggs right in your scalp. Richard had not shampoo. And to seal in that sheen, use this perfect Hudnut. shampoo finish. Richard Hudnut Cream Rinse. <laughs> what kind of a nut do you think a Hudnut that is? Disgrace of the base. The well, Hud is the uh, Department of Housing and Urban Development, so I assume it's some kind of housing-related nut. Mm. That's a terrible joke. Clothes. I'm going to start drinking. Adjust the rinse cycle. <laughs> That's for the bus. Machine okay. What Ooh. needs adjusting is your detergent. You sake suds and dash. You tend the machine. I'll tend to what goes in it. But that product over suds and hindered proper rinsing. Now Dash keeps suds down. Rinses thoroughly clean. Well, I'll keep suds down by using less soap. That sacrifices Use less soap, cleaning Sam. Power. Use Dash less hug it gives best yes. possible cleaning without... Well, actually, we worry. just went over that today because uh, we talked about cleaning cast iron pants and you also have to use less soap when... You should, you should use Dash for that. Yeah. Put them in the. Using dash I was about to say the best way to clean the cast iron pans is to put them in the washing machine. Exactly. Oh, okay. it's me. So here's our feature film, Queen of the Amazons. All right. I like to put my pants in the microwave. Oh, that's good too. Um, all right, so we'll talk about this movie a little bit here. Um, this is a 1946 adventure film. That cat looks so old. Like it looks like an old man. It's seen some things. Oh, the yeah. Cat. <laughs> Doesn't he look like an old man? It looks like it has an old man's face. Like a human man. He's seen some things. I love it. Yeah. Um, okay, so this is an adventure movie set in the jungle. Even though it says Amazons, I think they're in India, so they're obviously very confused about where the Amazons were. Hey, okay, Christopher Columbus was also confused. Well, yes, of course. See, look, there's India. Akbar. Oh, Admiral Akbar from Star Wars. This is where he's from? This, yeah, this is where he's from. But you didn't know he was Indian. Is that a cow? Is that cow? Is that I think that's an elephant. Oh. Stop. They'll flag you. 
<laughs> yeah, she's been flagged so many times, it's not even worth it. They love me here. Absolutely. I don't think any of my videos have gotten there's taken down, so... Not yet. Well, there's always time. This is another chance. Ah, this must be the Amazonian woman. Yes, in her pants. Together. In spite of what you see, the situation in Far East is rather disturbing. There's another yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, okay, so we have... This woman is determined to find her fiancé who went on a safari and didn't come back when expected. Oh my gosh, did he meet Tarzan and get married? This is like a yes. multi-Disney adventure. It's just like Kingdom Hearts. She travels to Akbar, India with Greg's father. I guess Greg is her husband. Colonel Jones, who's one of these idiots. Who narrates the film. Oh boy. I like Pat. Together with Wayne Monroe, played by Keith Richards, not that Keith Richards, which we already talked about on the pre-show. And the professor, also not the professor from Gilligan's Island. It's just the professor. I don't know how long we're Well, that actor would have been about 12 when this came out. It's the professor from the Powerpuff Girls. Uh, you can help us. Ah! Okay. It's also not not him either. I don't, I don't think. I, maybe maybe it is. I don't know. She asks about Jones at the front desk. I guess that's this scene here, and that's good enough. Oh, there's a native woman named Tondra. Tondra? That's probably her. I'm guessing. Like looking for a needle in the haystack. Wayne, you like my razor thin before, mustache. We'll Is she supposed to be hidden back there? Notice that little native girl. Yeah, she's uh, real I sneaky. Thought she seemed particularly interested. But that's just she's what almost as sneaky as Batwoman was. Oh, yes. Oh, she's gone. I mean, when she was in that hallway sticking her ass out and those two guys couldn't see her. That is exactly what I said. Call me the cool one. So, um, the main actor in this is named Robert Lowry. He was in, he, he played Batman in a serial that came out a couple years before this. Oh, there was a serial with Batman on Yeah, that's what I was thinking too. Wow. Yep. Yep. And it's on Rift Tracks if anybody wants to check it out. It's pretty funny. I really like Captain Crunch. <laughs> Captain Crunch. But the peanut butter kind reminds me of dog kibble, so. Uh. Well, Mm. Cereal is I just human Tandra. kibble, Sam. You, are looking for white you start acting like a body? dog. Why, yes, she gets Tandra down on all fours and starts sniffing. I'm looking for the man I'm engaged to marry. Facts. Greg Jones. Moyo told me of Lost Safari and Lone White Man. Now, do you what? think that lady is actually Indian? Because I don't think so. Safari. I don't think so. I was Last also going to ask as a clarification. So she is not... They're actually going to go to the Amazon, right? Kitty! Um, no, they stay, I think they stay in India the whole time. So this non-Indian woman, dressed as an Indian woman, is playing a yep. native member Indian. Well, somebody in here is Zeta the Amazon Queen. That's one of the characters. Look at this guy. <laughs> oh my gosh, I think he'll be okay. Rawr! <laughs> That's exactly how Kiki plays with me. These are trained tigers, I hope. I don't know. Tundra, they look a little skinny. Would you bring your husband here? Yeah. They must be vegan. Well, they don't comment on your figures, you. Sam. They can't comment at all. They're dead. Oh, that's probably true. Damn. Anna bringing the truth. I think I can make it worth your while. Here's three rupees. I think those are the, the money that they have in India, right? Rupees? I think so. Sure, why not? Well, that didn't work. Maybe they're going to the circus. Wait, what is happening? Like, why are they parading in the street? Uh, it, it's Elephant Day, apparently. Showing off their trunks? <laughs> yes. The government is they're having a trunk off. Look at that. Because the people oh, they're fighting. Oh, that's good. It's like baseball or football in our country. The oh, they're between two some kind of sport? Oh, oh, oh I see him. It's like a joust. Trunk jousting. Yeah. <laughs> trunk, trunk jousting. That sounds amazing. 
Yeah, if you're a uh, men also like to do that. On going to the do that. At a time like this. Some men. This yeah. yeah, ask any, any But not all men. Oh, I, I should ask myself because... I didn't say rest, I said unrest. Do you trunk joust, Ryan? <laughs> do I? I Is that what you and David were doing the other day? Uh, no. I disavow any oh, trunk jousting okay. that may have occurred. Suspicious. Now, Don't Anna, I think you can wear, you can wear that outfit Mario. there. Which How one? Do do? Will be glad to tell you Any of them can. in this scene. Perhaps you have a picture of the young man you I do have a body, oh, yes, I and have. I could probably wear all three of those outfits, maybe even at the same time. I'm pretty cool. They're so cool uh, that you have a body. Do not in last safari. Are you, are you jealous? Even though it's falling apart. Yeah. They hunt what? elephant ivory. Body, yaddy, yaddy, Big yaddy. Tusks, you know, so high. They first go to sea town. Who was so high? Go to Kaibo in Africa. He said someone was so high. Listen, I tell Probably you. Probably Keith Richards. <laughs> the, the curtain shot them. Recoil back. <laughs> That's Alfred Hitchcock. You will notify the police at once. Have you guys ever seen those old Alfred Hitchcock TV shows? Probably not. Yes, I, mm -hmm. uh, I think I've seen like a clip maybe, but I haven't watched the show. In the very beginning, there's this kind of outline drawing of Alfred Hitchcock, like his caricature, and then he appears from off screen in like the silhouette, and then like it matches the drawing. It kind of reminds me of that. I don't know, you have to see it. It's kind of hard to describe. Come on, let's get out of here. Well, that's stock footage is getting out of control out there. We should do something. We make us look like pussies. Well, the man just said the great safari went out to Africa, and we can't afford to waste any more time here. Oh, maybe they are going to Africa. Wait, they're going to... They're going to Africa? So they're in India, and they're going to Africa. But the Amazon... And then the yeah. Americans. Amazon is nowhere near either of those places. All right, well, here we go. Hey, they're making their way. They're midway there. They should do that little red line when they, like in Indiana Jones, where it, it does the line. Oh, yeah, on the map? Yeah, yeah. Checkmate, Professor. Checkmate. We're playing checkers. <laughs> Draw all the sea creatures that are around where Nassie lives. More stock footage, okay. There's some alligators, I think. That was This is probably Florida. Right. The Amazon in Florida. Well, all the outside shit's probably stock footage of wherever. Like, they just bought this footage from somebody. Gene, when will you realize you're wasting your time in this search, buoying yourself up with false hopes? Oh, Wayne, easy. please. If Greg were alive, he'd have communicated with you by now. That is, if he right, like to. telepathically? And if like he's how dead, he's very long ago. With her. We'll never find any traces. Wayne, it was your idea to come with us. Now, if you want to go back, go back. Find wow, time to tell sassy. me that in the middle of nowhere with sassy. alligators and lions and savages Sassy all and brassy. <laughs> Girl, what's so funny, The Girl? best kind. I think it was Horace Greeley who Girl, what's said so there are times when it's more dangerous to go back than to your go Your face? Ahead. Well, I'm not Horace Greeley. I think we all shoot back. Ding, ding, it's dinner time. <laughs> well, now you know what that means, even on a trolley car. It means go ahead. It means you've all got syphilis. <laughs> so, um, Kaibo, I guess that's somewhere in Africa? Sure. I just came from the commissioner's office, and he's going to help us all he can. Oh, uh, Commissioner Gordon. won't allow us to go into the back country <laughs> without a guide. A lot of Batman in this movie for it not Gary being Lambert. Batman. And he hates I know. Women. I hope we see Batwoman in her cave. Mm. He thinks they're nuisance. Oh, we can only hope. Don't you worry, I'll take care of that. She'll take care of it for us. She's going to put on the cape. Well, you, you missed every me? time. <laughs> Why is he have a Here, domino on it? Oh. oh, what a pretty oh, bird. bird. So, I can't find a I can't find a Kaibo, but there's a Kobo in South Africa. I'm guessing that's where oh, they are. Oh, hello, Commissioner. Oh, hello, uh, Daddy. Is he going to kill that bird? Target, eh? Oh, my gosh, that's amazing. <laughs> and I'm going to send you somewhere where you'll need that good marksmanship. 
There's another confounded party. Yeah, when a tiger in leaps at you from the jungle and rips your well, face off, you'll need that. Business, you'll need that mark for sure. Allowing any more expeditions to start out while the natives are so upset. Well, it's it's uh, orders from the Home Office. Besides, there's uh, there's a girl with him. Ooh. Girl, huh? Well, you can count me out. You I don't like girls. You the start out after what uh. happened to the last one? Now, just the point, Gary. The man she's going to marry was with that last one, and she wants Ooh, to find him. Ooh, the Tell last the one. You know I'd do anything I could for you. But you ought to I'd marry you if it were legal. On they always want things I know. To get in the, the guy directing this in movie is Edward Finney. He was alive from Maybe 1903 to 1983. To All right. You might persuade her to give up the idea. Best known as the man who introduced cowboy singer Tex Ritter nice. to the movie-going public. Never heard of him. I have not heard of him. It's nice to go out right on the decade point, though. Yes, that's good. Damn, bitch! Whoa. Andy, get your gun! <laughs> <laughs> Jean Jean the young it. lady I was telling you about, Mr. Gary Lambert. Well, Annie Oakley, so this is interesting we because, again, in this period, and we've seen other serials and stuff from this period, the women usually don't do anything. So that's good that she's pew pew Oh, so this stuff. is that's like good. a very progressive feminist film. Well, you guys have seen, of course, the Zorro, the right? The Zorro shorts we've been... Yeah, I, I grew up on Zorro, actually, also. Well, well, the female Zorro, the one we're showing now, um, the serial... Zorro's hello, black whip. The, oh, the Zorro's female. I've been looking for you. Oh, fuck so, yeah. With yes, her being the such a good the shot, was she up. the one who I fired the gun? You going with us. It could Even be. There's, I mean, the maybe. Suspicious. I understand you're having Let's just say that it was, because it makes it more yes, interesting. Don't be suspicious. Don't be suspicious. What a slut. Why don't you come over to the general store with me and we'll talk to him together? I'd love to. So this director did a movie called Song of the Gringo. Out into the west. The sun <laughs> Sam, it's down. you. That was his <laughs> first. <laughs> Is that, well, this guy right here, that's that Sam. Oh, that's, no, Sam. that's Sam. Yeah, that monkey. <laughs> the monkey. <laughs> the monkey. <laughs> the monkey. <laughs> the monkey. <laughs> little to earn and many to keep, though the harbor bar be moaning. He also did. Three wives set up Text the rides with the Boy Scouts. The sun went down. Oh. Let's set, set about that the better. Um, <laughs> the, the, the Man the from Texas. Now, these titles are boring. I gotta so find cute. out. You are. Adorable. Strange Holiday. That, and also dangerous. Strange Holiday could be. Women are weeping and their hands so this is actually one of the last things this, the this director did. Mm. That's weird, because he was work. only... Well, he was 43 when he directed this. Maybe he just sucks so bad he couldn't get any more work. I don't know. Maybe he stopped uh, Trump jousting. That's me when I want attention. Well, how about Maybe he got bitten by that monkey and caught yeah, something. He stopped oh, trump jousting and put it down where he needed to be in this off. business. Now, yeah. <laughs> yes. Oh, yeah. So the um, the, fifth roll and that the lead actor, which I don't know if we've even seen him, but he's the guy who's supposed to have okay disappeared. Uh, Robert day, Lowry, on the Pearl of 1913 to 1971. He was on a bunch of stuff. Like I mentioned, he was. Oh, he was in the Mark of Zorro. That is the. I think that's the second serial which we have not. I love how they're in order of height, like the Mission Dolls. Yes. Well, they're like the, uh, the, the, the dolls, that, the nesting dolls, where they go inside of each other. Is that not what the Pushka dolls are? But I do. I do. Uh, maybe, but yeah, so the, the, the tubby guy goes inside of her, and then she goes inside of the big guy. Oh, that's what she said. Damn, girl. <laughs> wow. He likes a little face. Tell her you'll bring her messages yes. and gifts from her He people. was also in The Mummy's Ghost idea. and Dangerous to Passage. Now that sounds kind of myself. sexy. After I guess. all, if a cook is a cook, he's got to keep a cooking. <laughs> Supposing I talk to her, huh? Keep a cook. That's a good idea. You go right ahead and talk to her. You'll find her in back. Okay. What's he was in The Rise you and know, Fall of Legs English. Diamond. Just a little joke on the lady. <laughs> legs? <laughs> yeah, it's a mobster movie. Legs Diamond. I've been waiting for you. <laughs> good, good. I, he I was, was in the Cane Mutiny. Oh, okay. To tell you the truth, Gary, I had two reasons to urge you to go on this trip. He is best it known for the role of Big Tim Champion party. in the series well, Circus Boy. Big Tim. 
ship was sent out here on a mission. Circus boy. There's okay. There's a contraband ring working somewhere in the back country, shipping out. Oh, he was in an episode of Superman. And it was Isn't that exciting? To find and stop them. I see. We're just well, the first time a Batman actor had shared a screen so with a, a Superman actor. Which, which Superman? Which Superman, though? We'll find out the what one that was on TV. I'll see what I can do. Yes, sir. I like this bird. The black and white one. The bird Jimmy, is smarter than all of them the put together. Match. Absolutely. Yeah, I was thinking that. Like, it understood everything perfectly. Look at this. Oh, they had appeared. Oh, this is very interesting. So the Batman guy yeah, that I just you mentioned and the Superman actor got, appeared in a World War II anti-VD propaganda film called Sex Hygiene. Sex Hygiene? You boys be Sounds like a good stuff. band name. Now that, a long time that we could show on here. Oh, I'm sure. Be a good boy. <laughs> Don't make a monkey out of yourself. In fact, I'm going to go look for it. See if we can get it. Don't make a monkey out of yourself. <laughs> that sounds amazing. <laughs> oh, I will. I said Aladdin How earlier. You, That's Already. a boo. Commissioner, are you sure these maps I got to get back to my booze. Yes, yeah, sure. A booze. I suppose huh. he's got to go along. The commissioner mm -hmm. said quite definitely we can't go without him. You know, we have to do everything the commissioner don't says, don't we? There's no reason for you to make this long, dangerous trek. If you wow, go, I just hear like that. Why did it sound... There's no reason for you to make this dangerous check. I mean, she's the only chick in this movie. She's got to sound sexy. She's gonna protect them. Look at her. That was that native lady, but she's. I think she's gone. In a suit. Show her pants. Show her power. So speaking of pantsuit lady, she is the lead actress in this movie, 1915 to 2018. What? She was 103 when she cried. Oh, damn, girl. Shit. And that was when uh, medicine was not as good. So. Right. Impressive. That, my dear, is she was in a Sherlock Holmes movie opposite Basil Rathbone, who's a very famous Sherlock Holmes actor. He's probably the first Basil? one that... Basil! He's the first one that's really recognizable to folks like from back in the day. You should try it sometime, Colonel. As uh, Sherlock Holmes. <laughs> you should try it sometime. When they're small children, long what, Basil Rathbone? shoots yes. are forced into their flesh. The more pain they can bear, the more they are respected and admired. That's just like at a tattoo convention. The more pain you go through, the more <laughs> you're admired. Yes. She was in a movie called Allah Be Praised. That... Oh, what a beautiful uh, This is the end of the river. There <laughs> in 1949? Of Africa. Okay. Yes, but like many other beautiful things, it has its What if effect. this were like the... This is as far I don't know if this is breaking news to you guys, but Hollywood wasn't terribly enlightened in the 40s. <laughs> 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 so when they start doing stuff like mentioning Allah and like other cultures, it's probably not good. Oh, probably not. I see what you're saying. Yeah. Yeah. That makes sense. Is this the, is this the Amazon where they eat people? Like no, this is the Amazon. No, no, this is the Amazon where they ship stuff. Sam, what kind of other Amazon? But we sensed that we were coming closer than. Well, there's Amazon Prime. We don't yeah. talk about right. Jeff Bezos. Oh, okay. I'm he sorry. just said his name. I'll edit that out. Yeah, beep him out. <laughs> We're going deep into the jungle. He must not be named with the bald head. head. Bald head. Always, I should deploy some kind want. of annoying beef for, like, Tonga, censoring people. My best head man. But first, we have welcome dances for you. Come oh, out. good. You see. The Just what we wanted, a welcome dance. It likes to show them off. It wouldn't be good policy. All right, everybody, hunker down. It's going to take a while. Here we go. Ooh, drums. Drums hello. I'm shocked that there's drums Sam in Sam was a drummer. He's more cowbell. Absolutely. Cowbell would be, yeah. An we have a cowbell. I was a drummer. Yeah. Digeridoos? What are those things? Good question. That's uh, Those are trunks for jousting. Oh, jousting trunks. Okay. So, this actress was in Song of the Thin Man, Tarzan and the Huntress. Oh, Tarzan, I called okay. it. Look at that. Uh, Dress to Kill. The Prince of Thieves, which is an old... Oh, oh she look, played Maid Marian. Aladdin. Marianne. See? Yeah. Themed. There is. Remember, Professor, you're supposed to be interested in insects, but you find them in the strangest places. The Kiss of Death. Oh, dear. Smooches. 
What did he say about finding insects in the strangest places? After the ceremony, the natives mm. gathered in the marketplace where we bought the rest of our supplies. As we would Sam, Sam finds insects in the strangest places. Oh, she does, yeah. <sighs> <laughs> well, she does love insects. So much. Hi. I do not approve of incest. Oh, no, no. In, yeah, okay. I meant insects. Not what you no, said. She knows. Oh, you mean when, when you said that I find it anywhere, you meant insects? Oh, sorry. Yes. Ah. So, um, unsurprisingly, this movie has a 3.7 out of 10 on IMDb. What? <laughs> Is that high? That bird is stealing that high, the yeah. show, though. That bird is stealing the show. Look at it. The bird should have its own, mo his own movie. It really should. Well, bless my soul. Oh my gosh, it's that guy. It's, uh, what's his name? Cliff or something from Tarzan? Cliff Clavin? Cliff? Yeah, that guy with the little tiny stash he showed. Looks just like him. The bird? Yeah, the bird. With the Looks just like him. <laughs> In terms of IMDb ratings, 3.7 is about the norm for the movies that we do. Although we did have one time, I think we did one that had an 0.9. Wow. Like, really bad. You can have less than one? Oh, sure. Uh -huh. And then I think we had one that was a 7 one time. I couldn't believe Gary. it. Wow. Gary. Gary, are you masturbating in there again? He's oh, trying to chest Gary? Him. Gary was spanking it. See, look, he's got a shirt open and everything. He was, yeah, he was paddling pony. The, oh, she's trying to paddle him. Amazon, whatever you call them. <laughs> Amazon? Uh -huh. You don't really believe there's uh -huh. such creatures out here in the jungle, do you? You think well, those those black guys well, doing the dance for Amazon? Okay. We'll you want to see my jungle? Come on. Mm. <laughs> Show me your vines. It's funny, very um, unkempt. I want it's you funny to tell us seeing you know your about the picture on Discord be That's poison tough. ivy as you see. They know everything. Why <laughs> <laughs> do you think she keeps her uh, her privates? Tonga. In her pants. I think it's a bush. The white she devils speak. Are you talking time. about this lady or Poison Ivy from long, Batman? Long poison time. Ivy from Batman, because this is Batman. Poison. Did we not cover oh, that? I'm sure it's literally a well-kept like clover field where it doesn't really grow out, but it's still fluffy and soft. Oh. What do you mean, the movie clover field? Yes, there's a monster Men down there. Oh. This is some kind of narration that we're missing. This is critical. Women make it's having flashbacks. Yep, so hey, she devil, you Well, I finished now. off my beer already, she so now I'm on to the Amazon. doers. Do it. Do the do. Er. So, are we establishing that there are going to be two women in this movie? This, uh, here great woman and the she devil? Yeah, there, there's a character called the Queen of the Amazons in the cast list, so there has to be another woman at some point. But it's just the two. Well, there was that one in the beginning. I think she was just in that one. Scene. That's true. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, I forgot about her because she was hiding behind the plant and so hard to see. Oh, that's true. You barely, you barely saw I, her. Hardly, yeah. So. On the poster for this, it says, "Sensuous sirens, made for love or war." Even we're almost halfway through the movie, and I haven't seen Amazon 1 yet. So I, we're, we'll they're say. not even in the Amazon yet! <laughs> <laughs> they're ha almost halfway through the movie, and they're in Africa. Yeah, they're lost. I think they should ask for directions. That bird probably knows. That's why it's freaking out. It's he like, hey. Does. Bird's like, you, you, you fuckers. We're like 10,000 miles away from where we're supposed to be. Yeah, Zorro out here. Different Zorro. They should have Zorro. <laughs> yeah, try try looking through the other end, dummy. Oh, okay. One piece. Now use your open eye. They certainly seem to be in the Are zebras black with uh, white stripes or white with black stripes? Yes. 
have a... Actually, there are uh, rare white zebras, oh. so I think their base color is white. Yeah, every once in a while, they're... they have one at the zoo. Yeah. Well, I figured it was, because I think their tummies are white, right? You look, you look. Yeah, but there was one born without any stripes, which is rare. Sure. What were you gonna ask? So they just call it a horse? You know what? Yeah, it's a uh, oh, horse. Yeah, right. No, I was gonna ask if you guys had seen Naked Gun. No, but did you know that in D and D unicorns are not related to horses? Ask him where he found us. He said white man give it to him. They look like horses. They're not related. It's clearly stated. Except for the horn. Are, are, they, are they related to rhinos? Oh, zebras? I don't know. But it's not yeah. horses. I know it's not horses. Narwhals? Is it hobgoblins? Probably. That makes more sense. The direct descendant of hobgoblins. What are these guys doing? I don't know, but I heard a theory that unicorns were actually rhinoceros. Right. Very skinny rhinoceri. Ew. You seem troubled about something. I didn't want to tell the others. You seem troubled. Let's get naked. Yes. This native boy. Oh, I know why I couldn't find the place that they said they were going because it's in Australia, not Africa. <laughs> There's so many places. I know. Wait, so they went to Africa, but to uh, Australia, Africa, in the Amazon? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yes. So, no, the place name they showed on the screen when they went to Africa is actually in Australia. Amazing. And they're in the Amazon in Africa in Australia. Correct. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> Kitty. Okay. Kitty wants a hug. But that's Liliana right there. Yeah, you just have to rub his tummy. It's fine. It's a druid. It's a druid. Yeah, oh, yeah, there you go. It's a druid tr trying, to make, trying to make. I was about to say Halson. I'm having some flashbacks to the bear. <laughs> you guys give us some privacy, please. <laughs> She's like, I was going to peg him first. No, I can't. What are they doing? What an innocent question. I mean, you know what they're doing. Come on now. Yeah. Will somebody take his pants off so we can get this over with? Oh. They're just trying to lie in the round. <laughs> they were just cuddling. I love the professor guy. He's just like staring like a dumbass. Well, that's one I owe you, mister. I guess that puts me ledger now. So I'm barely injured after all that. I was about to say, he sure came out of scape. He's got one scratch on his how's arm. His, anyway. How's his butthole, though? Well, oh. Colonel. Don't ask. Don't tell. Let's just say when he goes to pr when he goes to prison later, he's gonna be well suited. What do you mean, Wade? Well, I'm convinced he'll be the most popular bell at the ball. Aww. Oh, that's nonsense. What could they have to gain? That's just it. I don't know. Well, who could it be anyway? Who could it be now? Gary. I don't know, but I'm gonna find out. Gary's the sexy one. Remember? I know you'll think I'm There's nothing sexy about the name Gary. That animal was <laughs> Princess Bubblegum. What about Gary Coleman? <laughs> no, no, no. Gary Coleman? Yeah. Do you know who that is? I sure do. Okay. You don't think that's sexy? Dead. Well, that's true. After what you've just been through, I can't help feeling jittery. Well, that's all right, Jean. Don't let it upset you. I'm sorry. Don't let it upset you. Really don't blame yourself. Your biceps are huge. Kiss me. Are they? Okay, but my cat scratches me up worse than that. Yeah. <laughs> Your most recent scratch. That goes all the way across my tit. <laughs> she kicked off of me. She likes to use her claws to hold on. But she doesn't remember that, like, they are claws. So she kicks off of me with them out and just, like, slices through my skin, like... I haven't been able warm to tell knife so through far butter. Well, I didn't know how far I could trust you. <laughs> All the kind That's I the best kind. Well, I sort of. You sort of what? Sort of like you. I sort of have, you have a girl boner for you. Degree. Girl I boner. So I naturally concluded that I've got a fake one I can put on. You certainly wouldn't have started on <laughs> <a> <laughs> search if you hadn't. That's, that's what he likes. Together. I've known him all he my likes getting pegged. I've never even thought of marrying anyone else but Greg. That's Greg. Except he's so god awful boring that doesn't mean i can't have friends good friends uh-huh like friends of benefits 
Well, yeah. I thought we were talking about Gary. Who's Greg? Is that the way he wants it? No. But I can't. You know, they're all just these interchangeable. I made it quite clear to him many times that we could never be anything. I'm already bad enough with names. I can't have this happening. Even if I didn't love Greg, I couldn't (laughs) care for Wayne. There's a Greg and a Gary. That's me? terrible. That like the writer awful. should have come up with a different name. One of them is <laughs> too similar. I That's like having a Matt and a Mike. What if you didn't? It's like, how about a Scott or a Wayne or different. something? Like something that sounds vastly sure different than me. the same guy. Why, I don't know. Richard. I've always thought Greg was the only. It's like having a oh, David oh, and a wait. Daniel. Or Mary. I guess I had it fixed in my mind. Well, I don't think her oh, pants are hiked up high enough. And a Rory and a Tory. Mm, no, don't do that. That's what I'm trying to do. Did you know Sam was going to be called Tory? Good night. No, I was going to be called Good Tony. Night, oh, yeah. See oh, what I mean? You still are. <laughs> it's like the same name. Uh oh. Whoa. Whoa. Jump scare. From nowhere. Oh my gosh. Ice Queen. And Shira. She goes. Look at Catra! Oh my gosh, make them kiss, make them scissor. Which one is Sam? <laughs> Sam is a uh, Adora. It's on our. Uh... That's Catra. I'm Catra. I'm Catra. Oh, you're and you're Adora. It's on our Netflix. Because I'm adorable. You're adorable. And also, you wear your hair in pussy. I love pussy cats, they're beautiful. You guys could go as you guys could go as the princess of power for Halloween. Oh, oh my gosh, know. I want to be Mermista. No, but no. Do have. you understand what Rory's saying? Because yeah, like you could go as Adora and I could go as Shira. Because I'm taller than you. No, no, someone has to be Catra. Shush. Kiki can be Catra. Oh, you can dress Liliana as Catra. Kiki can I want to be Seahawk and Mermista. Oh my God. Who's Seahawk? Yeti agreed to guide Who's Seahawk, Sam? Uh, I'll be Seahawk because for Mrs. Hot and you're hot. Because you're from Seattle. Aww, you're hot too, baby. There's been a white man injured. Come There's on. a white man injured. Oh my god. Drop everything. <laughs> man is dead. Oh my gosh. He's, he's not just injured, he's, he's dead. dead. Just like Gary Coleman. I kind of buried the, exactly. This is how Gary Coleman went. He was just walking through the jungle, and then he got speared. Is Gary Coleman the one who invented the the Coleman lunchboxes? Yes. And the grill? That footprint was meant to yes. look like a native's, but it was made by a white I got to mix up with George Surely Foreman for a second. How can you tell? Mm. Whoever made that print was accustomed George to Foreman shoes. is quite a bit taller than Gary Coleman, and what also still me, alive. As far as we know, the only white men within miles of here are in this camp. Mm. The only white men. murderer. What? I think the monkey is going to outsmart all of them. No, we already established the bird is the smartest. One of the bird, but then the monkey is right below the bird. That's true. That's kind of the pecking order of intellect. And then there's a huge gap, and then the dudes. Oh, the woman is above all them, and then the dudes are, like, way down there. Yeah, there's, like, a slight gap, then there's the woman, and then there's a huge gap, and then there's the men. Right. And then there's an even huger gap, and it's the white men. Right. Well, uh, I mean, none of the men have proven to be terribly intelligent so far. The tigers look really. I, I don't know how skinny they were back then, like if that was the norm, but they look really. <laughs> Not well. I think, I think it's the same as now, Sam. I don't think they've changed. No, like, tigers that I've seen, like, on TikTok. Oh, but uh-huh. I was about to say... Do they like, have their own TikTok account? I feel like zoo tigers and, like, tigers in captivity get fed a little bit Oh, Simba. Bit Simba, isn't that from Lion King? Yeah. Yes. We have a whole Disney theme going. Disney and Batman together. If you say that one more time, we're going to get flagged. You're right. Don't say the D word. <laughs> that guy's very greased up. I'm just saying this me is a little creaky because I'm getting old. But his courage and confidence were well, yeah. disappearing. Getting old. Flag Hilarious. Crazy. You're like 20, 20 years younger than me. So. <laughs> that's me. Right that was or me. Or Anna, whoever you are. We're the same person. It's okay. Yeah, okay, that's fine. We are, we are oh. the same age, so I guess you're right either way. You're older than I yeah, That's am. true, you are. I thought you were Sam. You're the spinster. Yes. I'm 
I'm tearing through this door, so I should probably slow down. Wait, wait, wait. Now we're up. walking, now. Did you see, like, the man's running and this cat's just power walking? <laughs> it's like it's going to the suburban neighborhood. Ah, no! <laughs> Look at that guy's face. That was a much more realistic attack than with uh, the other guy. Yeah, well, I mean, these are all trained animals. Well, They're not really going to attack anybody. Well, yeah, but I'm just saying that was a much better he alone one. Had the directions. Well, yeah. The well, also, I don't think the guy and the tiger were anywhere killed. near each other in real life. Mm. Evidently, well, I think I shot way. the guy and did a, like, a no, reaction shot, gone, right? He's just like, ah! And then, like, later they shot the tiger doing Gary, stuff. it can't be much further. Because if you don't see them in the same shot, then they weren't together. I think we're pretty close to what we're looking for. Right. Go they didn't do like multi camera shit back then. All right, so you gentlemen? It was basically mm -hmm. just like one well, camera. We'll go on. Oh, yeah, Although I, I didn't. I learned very recently problem. that uh, three camera sitcoms are a thing where they just have three cameras. I didn't know that. Wow. Well, they just Before now we they go, just call it multi camera because usually it's. Yet lion. They anyway, think yeah. I thought it was always just like a random number. I didn't know it was specifically idea, three. Good luck to you and your men. Where you can really see that shit is in the these so soap operas. So in soap operas, you'll see like a long shot of the whole room, the and there's a camera on person one, and there's a camera on person two, right? And then you'll see it constantly switching back and forth. Like that's where you can really see it. And like old, uh, the old sitcoms like from the 70s and 80s. Same thing. Guess that's all gonna get you out of you is uh, kind of a sitcom, uh, opera, op what is? Op soap opera, sitcom. Sitcom opera? Uh, so, so, soapcom. Soapcom. Look at these dopes. Are those the Amazons? Maybe. There's some more animals. They should have called this like the Jungle Voyage or something. There's no Amazon in this. Not that I've seen. There's more Amazons on this call than there hey, are in this movie. A unicorn. There it is. Zebra looked fake. Is that, is that just me? Or does that zebra look fake as fuck? <laughs> that looks like someone in an outfit. <laughs> just some guy in a zebra outfit. That no, was I think sus. it's just a very young zebra. That's the imposter. Oh, it's a, oh, it's a spy. The imposter among us. A fungus among us. Dun, 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 dun. Well, we've got... Uh, 22 minutes left. Still haven't seen Amazon 1. Keeps checking the time. He's like, when is this over? <laughs> well, no, I was just wondering how much time was left because I'm like, where are the damn Amazons at? The lions are getting bored. They're like, man, fuck it. These guys aren't worth the trouble. Are they trying to hunt him? Her? I guess. I don't know. Oh, they're looking for Simba. Simba's like, you know what? Fuck it. <laughs> There's a tax one of them. Simba. It's like filmed from the back of a jeep or something. <laughs> it was filmed with a potato. These guys are <gasps> idiots. Sorry, the film quality is just not. <laughs> yeah, it's not the best. What is that? A lion. That looked like a bad taxidermy. That just looked like a bad taxidermy. <laughs> I always have mixed feelings of looking at bad taxidermy. Oh, come on. I didn't want to see murder of animals in this. Um, hopefully it's a fake animal. I'm pretty sure they had... Well... Did they have lost? I don't back know. Uh, they didn't really have, like, PETA and stuff in the 40s, so it could be a real... It would be animal. such a waste of money to train a lion and then actually kill it, though. So, like, there's no way they would have Well, that, that could have been... That could have been footage from an actual Finally, hunt, though. Like, they could have gone out and filmed these tribesmen the hunting a real animal. I mean, they could have. Somewhere close ahead of us was the forbidden territory. I don't I mean, I don't know. Presided over by the dreaded white goddess and the savage tribes under her domination. The white goddess? Here we go. Wait, is the other woman also <gasps> white? Of course. That's the queen. Okay. That's her right there. A Sasquatch. That's... Take the burrito's nose, Greg. That's the queen of the Amazon? Uh, or, sure. No, that's her. Okay. I can, Looks just like her. I couldn't tell. She's a great shot. Uh, not really. You know, 
I mean, she barely pulled that bowstring back. I don't think that would. I was gonna say, being a good shot with a gun does not translate automatically to a bow and arrow like that. That's a little unrealistic. You would know. Why do you ask? You seem restless, uneasy. You seem young and the restless. Of course not. I've never been happier than my life. Her name is Zena. Yeah. No, I think it's Zima, like the alcohol. Oh, eczema. Like the skin Ooh, condition. she's got a whip. Oh, no, it's, it's Zita. She Z-I-T- could whip me. Z-I-T-A. I'm, I'm sure she Someone could. Someone has to be bossed here. Oh. Whoa. So you got to grab some. <laughs> grab, grab a handful. Greg, Tony's been hurt. Oh, no. Who's Tony? Oh, the tiger? Or me. It's a lion. It's a bullet. Oh, you're Tony, yeah. And bullet means stranger. Stranger. Bullet means stranger. That's Greg, true. She's chilling on her chair. Is this you and Kiki? <laughs> is that is the tiger's name Greg or the lion? That no, is me and Kiki, though. You are. Yeah. I just want to stay here and meet these people. Greg is the boring you know, white guy. It's been a long time since I've seen. Hey, we, well, it's a boring outside. white name, so yeah. Greg, That's the guy that played Batman. At the council meeting. That's it's the only way we can keep the ladies in line, and we just can't take any chances on being absent. That's true. If that's what'll make you. They happy, require a hundred percent attendance. Take any chance in being abstinent. I knew you would, darling. Right. No, definitely not. Oh, there's no abstinence here. Is darling a word that they would use in the Amazon? Sure. Tony. The the, li- the lion taught her that word. Well, I don't think that they would we'll be speaking English. <laughs> um, probably not. Her English is superb. Okay. So um, I, I want to mention one thing. So this trope of a white woman being like in charge of some tribe that comes from an old novel from like the 1800s um, called She, which basically what the plot of that is: these guys get lost in the jungle and they find this tribe and it's, there's like this white woman in charge of them. And it appears in like Tarzan and a bunch of other that's shit that's also trope? kind of the same deal. This is oh my gosh. Oh yeah, that absolutely. time I got reincarnated into a white woman in the jungle. But only three yeah, absolutely. <laughs> in fact, we showed uh, the movie She on here, I think in season I three. She, 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 she. she. Well, I for one she, 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 I feel it's my duty to go. Yes. Thank you, I'm going to of course. That's impossible. Jim, this may be an ambush. We don't know She's thrusting her chest out for some reason. She's thrusting somebody. It may be a trap. You remain here with Tonga, the natives. Does she walk around with the strap on? We don't come back. They'll get you out safely. Probably. I'm quite sure the professor won't mind staying behind with Conga to take back news. She's got that strap. Conga. Who's Conga? Either that or she's like She's like a Gabrielle. In that one episode where she put no that little like knife portal. between her titties. Let's get out of here. Uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> what show was that? Zena. Oh, oh, oh. We started watching Zena recently. <laughs> oh yeah. You mean rewatching? Rewatching. Yeah. I mean, I grew up watching it, but. They all worship you. So I did my battle cry people. at the start. Which one of them do you identify with? <laughs> The most. It's kind Zeta. of hard to decide on that because um, I am physically disabled. But before I go, I want you to promise me. Well, I'll just pick one. Zena. Yes, Greg. We're not going to hold you to it. I feel like I'd beat people up if I could. I do. Yeah. It's probably why God made it impossible. Yeah, I think I would think I'd be Gabrielle. I want to think that I could be Zena. That's what Gabrielle thinks. That's perfect. Exactly. <laughs> no, you're, you're more of a Gabrielle. Yeah. I haven't seen that show in a very long time, but I, I know the basics. I like the animated movie I used to watch. I don't know if I'd like it now, but I liked it when I was a kid. That had Hercules in it. We were watching it trying to figure out what everybody's like class uh, would be. Like the like D&D yeah, class? Yeah, 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 yeah. Or like the classes they took in college. Territory. Everyone Aren't those the different knows things? That strangers are not welcome here. Um, sometimes. We've come to investigate a rumor. Do you like my bustier? What made you think Paladin? All the party were killed except one. Really? Yeah. Whom you're holding Catholic. prisoner. My warriors resent strangers. They my are warriors. Strangers. All who attempt strangers. to invade the country. If I had been informed in time, 
I might have been able is she to like Dutch? What's, her, what's this accent? Yeah, I'm trying to figure out what is Pennsylvania but Dutch. She's like, <laughs> they were like, they were like, you're a white woman who was raised in the Amazon rainforest of Australia and Africa. Make sure that you do uh, the right accent. Yes. She's like, um, okay, you're paying me $35 to do this movie, so you're going to get what you get. Make yourself comfortable. Thank you. Everyone starts taking off their clothes. All right, well, I polished off my doers. You must be tired after this long So you just got fireball left? Like All I have left is fireball. Thank you, that'd be fine. It's happening. We have guests. Fireball. Fireball. I was explaining to Miss Preston that it was almost impossible to find They have alcohol? The Will they import it? Would be convinced. Without first making every effort to find out if it's here. Is that a refrigerator? So there a reason for this sure. Yeah, Sam. I think that's a door. Fridges that's a door. grow Two in the Amazon. To oh, yeah, that's true. Territory. Don't you know that? Perhaps. Yeah, we got ours from the Samsung Grove. I know that. You think I am stupid? Deep, no, you're Gabrielle. We set up barriers against <laughs> I see. Yeah. Well, I'm afraid we are imposing on you, forcing ourselves in here this way, but you can understand. We he made me think of, uh, of course, Colonel, we've been understand. watching a Brazilian sitcom, and the common catchphrase the is the grandma is saying, go to hell. Yeah, I know that. And your visit it made me think of that. It's funny you said that, because I brought I that show you. up, like, three and times already, and Rory was just like, what? what? And you didn't even catch it? Really? Oh, I was probably oh, getting the pizza. told me all about you. Really? Really? Is that the show I watched when I came over? Well, this is very yeah. enjoyable, but uh, oh, after okay. all, my dear, yes, it is. we came here on a definite mission. Yes. They have a whole ass buffet table thing set sheet. up here. It's extraordinary. An ass buffet? What, what is that? <laughs> all you can eat, Already baby! <laughs> all right, I'll drink to that. <laughs> yes, he's a remarkable boy. Inspiration. And, uh, so <laughs> that's, that's a lot of fireball. I right. Understandable. I have to drink it now. I landed here as a child when now this fireball, I was told that there's two the different coast. fireballs in terms of the proof, which is oh, the really? alcohol content. Yeah. Now, and I think what I ended up buying was the lower alcohol content. And there are no white men. Oh. No white men. Probably a good idea. It's not worth tomorrow. Uh, well, we have often ish. considered to invite desirable white settlers Just drink enough here. of it to make up for it. many of our girls have reached a suitable age to marry. I'll we'll have to make up for you guys not drinking. I was about to say, I uh, love how Sam money, was like, well, it's probably for the best not because your health. May and I, I was just like, you alone. more. Oh, it wasn't about his health. It was about no. work. No, it had nothing to do with health. Do what you want. I mean, he'll be sober by tomorrow. Do you want to fill yourself with poison? Go ahead, I say I as I drink an important blue uh, but he'll be food dye. Before you leave. <laughs> yes, I know. I have no intention of leaving until he does get back. You still think I'm holding him here against his will? Poison. I still think I'm holding him here against his Poison. What's that song? <laughs> Bell Bib DeVoe? Poison. Back but it isn't true. Right, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I was thinking about and angel I'm dust. I believe that when I hear I'm sure you were. You don't suppose that you don't you don't do angel dust, do you? No. She doesn't drink, but she does angel dust. <laughs> right. <laughs> she likes she likes snorting PCP, but she won't take a drink of alcohol. Okay. But I thought it <laughs> No, I just like scooters. I don't see that there's anything to settle. Uh, but Greg has promised to marry you. Uh oh, now we have to check. Greg. Greg. These two women are talking about a man, so they failed the Bechtel test. Damn. She looks like she's trying to secrete a fart. Yeah, she's like, <laughs> no oh, there it is. She got it out. Don't think no one will know it's me. He really wanted to be free. Stinkle the mile. Exactly. Honestly, of course I mean it. No kiss. Oh, she's got another one. to feel so sensible about it. Yeah, but the Amazon woman's getting turned on by it. Rather than give him up. I like your American you see, stench. Here in the jungle, such things are very easily managed. And I'm not bound by the conventional laws of society that She's bound by conventional laws, so Greg it doesn't really matter that it was the 40s, because... Yeah, and but it, it matters for the movie going All public. <laughs> They're not going to show that kind of stuff. Yes, the Amazonian scissor. Oh yeah, absolutely. <laughs> you want to do that later? 
And Greg really means that <laughs> much <laughs> Go rain the jungle, baby! <laughs> Don't make any mistake Partake in the ass buffet! Oh my god. Welcome to the jungle! Now You're gonna die! Happen. I don't feel Welcome like we to the jungle. Friends. We got fun again. Why not? <laughs> did I sound like him? I think I did. Yeah, that was perfect. I, was minding my own business I, don't, and this I don't know if you've heard and Axl Rose recently, but he sounds like Mickey Mouse on stage. I'm going to be completely honest with you. I did not realize Axl Rose was still alive. I thought he was still alive. Somehow, somehow he is. Somehow, yeah. <laughs> Ruth Bader Ginsburg dead, Axl Rose still alive. That's really unfortunate. We live in a simulation for sure. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Now, what's this all about? I see you're worried about Miss Preston. I assure uh -huh. you, she's quite safe. I'm worried that you're That's not going to double team me. Sure. That's got to be Pennsylvania Dutch. I mean, like, what yeah. is that accent? Well, you can tell by the chin trip. beard. You spend hours together. Ah, yes, the chin beard. And along she rides a horse and buggy jungle, around the jungle. Sam, you should do an accent for the rest of this. What kind of accent would you like? That's good. You come. Okay. So long as it's not Herbert the pervert. Well, you seem to know. What's wrong with Herbert the pervert? You don't like his sh action? You gotta keep that accent up for ten more minutes. I think you know all about a lot of things. I wish I knew some of them. I'm sure you do. I wish I knew some of them. In fact, I don't think there's very much happening in this job. You have to get the whistle in there. That's that's good. I got fat front teeth to make it happen. She was too good at that. You know, you seem very friendly, Slush and I wonder just how friendly you are. <laughs> yeah, we're definitely going to get a copyright strike now. I will. You're welcome. <laughs> I didn't come out here just to guide Miss Preston. we got to finish strong, you know. What did I say the other day? The Nothing but way. mid with me. That's right. And I want you to tell me the name of the leader of your organization. <laughs> organization? What do you mean? I think we understand each other. I think Contraband we understand Ivory. each other. You're asking for trouble, Mr. Lambert. The He's asking. Thief, I came out here to Look, get what's it, it going to take for you to blow me? That's all I want to know. <laughs> she looked down when he said that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there was an uncomfortable <laughs> silence. She's like, she's like, she was well, thinking about it. She's like, what will it take? Why well, not tell him. Need I go on? Well, let me tell him what it'll take. Make sense to me. Didn't very clear to me either. Now they're gonna. Yeah, she's me. gonna have to get past Down these three. Though they're, they're in line. I'm a little surprised, Zeta, that you would dissolve our Who holds a gun like that? Oh, yes. Yeah, was it? A, it's like a I've Tommy gun. This, Greg, for some time, but well, I mean, like he's pointing it like one. He's got sticks out more than a gun does. Like, I know. <laughs> <laughs> I don't do more damage. He's got terrible posture. <laughs> like, he just body slams one of them. He's really just like <laughs> leading with jungle. his stomach. He's like leading back. When the little bomber was about to guide you here, I, I took care of him. Ooh, I'm took care of him, huh? Monroe, Damn. He learned too much for his own good, and now you've all learned too much. <laughs> You all know too much. You weren't the, the birds like what? The birds like whatever. You guys don't know shit. My warriors will take care of you and your friends, Mr. Lambert. The warriors. That sounds great. They're gonna take care of us. Cool. So everybody who's in charge is white, even though everybody Correct. who lives here is not. Okay. All Correct. right. Yes. Okay. Okay. Again, this is the 1940s. This is a common theme in America. Yeah. Welcome to 1940s filmmaking. I'm surprised we haven't seen someone with blackface yet. Yeah, thankfully you know I don't I don't think that's gonna happen. That's a really good point because I don't think it would have been past them to just do that. So Oh no, they would have if they needed to, they just don't need to. I mean instead of that they just don't have any black characters that do anything. But yeah, if they did, Get some water, quick. right? If there was some black character that was actually doing something, yeah, there's a good chance of being black. Oh, you know, he character. got him with the fake out. Oh shit! Oh, oh yeah. shit! They were literally so obvious about it. He, oh, he elbowed him and then the he fell down like a damsel. I think this is the only trip. action. I think this is the only action scene in the whole movie. Clock him. They went all out. Yeah. Now they're gonna eat him. Gotta go. Maybe they'll eat his ass. The all you can eat, eaters. baby. Yeah. Well, he is wearing the cape. The cape from Batwoman. Welcome to the jungle. We got lots of ass. This reminds me of the goblin camp in um, in Baldur's Gate. You got some cast iron. Wash it up with dash. That guy. Is it because of all the gunfire? No, it's because of that one guy up there with the bow. 
turn. I can't see anybody with a boat. Whoa! Uh, are they fucking? <laughs> that just a random shot of insect incest? Yeah. Whatever. Bugology. Who put that in there? Bugology. I guess porn was scarce, though. They had to get what they got. Right. <laughs> they had to insert it where they could. <laughs> Ew. <laughs> hot. <laughs> That's hot. That's hot. Is that Paris Hilton? Yeah. Be whoever you want. I mean, talk about inserting it where you can. Good to see you, Dad. Good to see you, Dad. <laughs> Dan. Fire's gun. I'm not used to seeing you from the front. Oh, oh. Written us a letter and let us know you were alive. Not that I give a hang. Not that I give a hang. Such a casual conversation while they're like trying to commit murder. They're not even moving. Like nobody's even trying to hit them. They're just standing in place. They look like they're duck hunting. Well, the one guy's not even looking at the like. They're the fight. sitting ducks. Is that, oh, that, that's his holster. I okay, I like how he just pulled that out like that. That was uncomfortable. He's got a really pronounced jungle. I think it's oh, only that's, that that's because he leads with the stomach. Shall we say yeah. you're part in the same manner? No. No. Oh no! <laughs> what, what, what? Girl, you could have just. That was amazing. Well, my work here is done. Did they actually throw that spear? Because what if they missed? Time and time, um, wait for no man. I don't know how they did that. That was interesting. Destiny for any woman. That's good. Uh oh. Ooh. Machete kills. <laughs> wow, this guy sucks. <laughs> oh, no, kiss. He's like a Star Wars trooper. Right. Except he killed the queen of the Amazons, though. Or at least he stabbed her. No, he, he stopped. He stopped to the right of her. Oh, I thought it hit her in the gut. No, the spear went to the right of her. Oh, oh, I must, okay. Well, why is she still standing there, then? And she probably feels like he can't hit there twice. She, she's like, well, I'm safe if I stay here. No, no, it hit her. She's holding on to it. Maybe she just likes the shaft. The shaft, you say? Yeah. For you, Sam, I'm so excited. Right. Talking about shaft. That's done. <laughs> they spent the entire budget on this one scene. Probably they're breaking a lot of stuff. Like, why? He just threw the chair randomly. He didn't even throw it at him. He just threw it to the side. No, he doesn't like that chair. See, look, it's sticking in her. I think it's. I don't think it's on. I think maybe it caught her clothes or something. Now, who, who's this woman? Well, who the hell is that? There's this other random Amazon that just showed up. And she's white. So they do have more than one Amazon, okay. It's nothing. See? It ruined my life. And deliver me not only from It ruined my dress. It was to the side of her. It was like pinning her to the wall or something. I think it just got her clothes. Yeah, yeah, okay. He got lucky. got him on the run, Dad. He got lucky, babe. When I found you, I got you, babe. I'm bad. Are you no, bad? No, that was uh, Tom Petty. Sweet. Oh, he's dead. That's true. Everybody, apparently. Except Axl Rose. Wouldn't that be yeah. awkward if something happened? Right, like tonight we find out he's dead. Yeah. <laughs> I blame Sam. This sounds like the. Uh, I blame me too. This sounds like the Little Rascals music. <laughs> Professor, this is probably one of the first double wedding ceremonies that has ever taken place in a jungle. See, it's oh, it's well, Tarzan. The it's the, the dad and the the. Now the two girls are getting married, and the two guys are getting married, right? It is. It is an Another Ramadona. random bug shot. What, what is this? Like a spider to me. Oh yeah. Okay, you're right. It's an arachnid. Sorry. That ivory is going in the right direction at last. Oh dear, they got ivory. Mm. I'm leaving my wild jungle behind me. 
Well, I'm going to Peoria. You should see one of our nightclubs. Peoria? Mm. She's trading in the wilds of Africa for Peoria. Okay, what no even happened in that movie? Uh, no one knows. We do know, however, that that is the end. They went to find the leading man who was only in this movie for like three minutes. And he was like, thanks, dad. And that was it. Thanks. And nobody learned anything about geography. Correct. Also, there's an egg. There is. All right. So um, that was Queen of the Amazons. All right, Sam, what do you think? <laughs> I'm not a fan, but that's okay. <laughs> I think Satan's Cheerleaders in a previous episode was top tier content. Mm, top shelf. I, top shelf. I think they could have used a map at any point during the creation of this film. And mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <laughs> And I think they should have given more lines to the uh, to the monkey and the bird. Oh, yeah, for sure. And they messed up there. The monkey and the bird should have mm. been the center of attention. Um, this is a very strange dive into an alternate <laughs> universe earth where exactly. south america is africa yes their geography is clearly and also australia or australia yeah. or, Af or, or, or uh, well, pennsylvania yes yes all right well i want to thank um anna louisa for joining us and sam sano for joining us on this episode of Two Drunk Guys Watch. Next episode will be the conclusion of Zorro's Black Whip, along with a couple of choice shorts. Oh, another and, whip. Yeah, we'll hope to see you then. So until next time, keep things interesting.